Hello YouTube, Flame Nights on here. Today I'm going to show you a mini game that I made called Dodge the Blocks. So, let me just show you what it is. I turned on my block volume because it's really loud. You can just come over here, try to dodge the blocks here. And you get regeneration when you go in this gold block, but as you can see, I can't because, okay, so I just died. And there's a time. You can set that so it's either true or false. So let me. You, there's two ways you can do that. You can either get a book and just click remove time. Or you can click on help, time, uh, true or false. And you can also start it from the book. So. So yeah, actually I shouldn't have done that, I should have actually went over here, yeah, yep. regeneration, okay, so, yeah, it is possible, so, yeah, this world will be up for download, it is, um, 1.8, so, you have to be on 1.8, so now let me show you the redstone. Okay, so what happens is when you click this button, um, it says warming up, and then it takes a long time here, and then it just clears your inventory, sets your start scoreboard to one, um, makes you in survival mode, gives you invisibility. So this is multiplayer, um, and it also teleports you to the gold block and so yeah when oh yeah right here I think it's test four whenever you're on a gold block whenever you're, the gold block um that says three two one so it counts down you only have three seconds to be on it it also gives you regeneration for four seconds two one and then it teleports you one block away. It sets uh, this block right here, redstone block, and then sets it back to air. So this is like the cooldown. And then it says gold blocks open. And this is when you die. So when score timer. Timer is just time since death is a maximum of 13. Then it sets this block right here to air because it's normally a redstone block which I'll show you what it does um... it's this one, okay yeah um... and now it teleports you anyone with the start scoreboard of a minimum of zero it'll teleport you back to like the starting area and then over here it's set block and it's command so it sets a command block the dated value of zero. Uh, and sets the command to just set block air because it, it says it's activated and stuff. So um, over here it just scoreboard player it sets your start to zero. Over here it sets your time to zero. And here it just sets the command block uh, set block air. Now this is the time remove, and no, this is the t adding the time. This is removing the time. So when you add the time, it just sets this block back to air. It adds a time variable, which is dummy. Uh, it just sets it to ten. Sets the scoreboard sidebar, and then here it just says that it added the time. Here it's just basically opposite. It's just like remove time and then it says remove the time um, this is when like this is like the timer so this is scoreboard players remove so this removes anyone 
with a start minimum of one, it removes one from their time variable. And this tests for anyone with a time of zero, and it sets their start start to zero. So that and then it says you won or you win. Um, this sets your start to zero. Yeah, this already sets your start to zero. <laughs> um, this just teleports you back to the starting area. This sets your time back to a hundred. And this sets this this command block back, so it doesn't. So this doesn't stay on. And so now, when you put a redstone block here, redstone goes down here. Oh, I guess it doesn't. It goes the other way. So it goes over here. And just powers all of these rails. So when this goes over here, it just goes over there. And so that's what makes all the pistons go up like in that wave kind of look. And just this is just Telra. It just this just what does it say? This is just time, and then it sets a block up here, removes, and then it just does it again. So yeah, that's about it. The download link and yeah, the download link will be in the description. Thank you for watching. Bye.